Hi, my name's Newman. I'm one of the medical students from the University of Leicester. Can I just confirm your name and date of birth, please? Okay, so it's Harry Thompson, 10th of May, 1996. Brilliant. And how old does that make you, Harvey? I'm Mr. 21. Okay. Nice to meet you, Harvey. So I'm here to do a shoulder examination today. So in the shoulder examination, I'm going to be having a look at your shoulder, having a feel of your shoulder, and asking you to do a few movements for me. Does that sound okay? That sounds great. Perfect. For this examination, I'm going to have to ask you to be exposed from the waist above, so I'm going to have to have a clear view of your shoulders. Is that okay? That's fine. Okay, would you like anyone else present at this time? That's fine. Okay, that's fine. I'm just going to wash my hands and I'll be back in a minute. You, you can get ready if you want. So, I'm just going to have a look um, around your shoulder if that's okay. Okay. So, I'm going to ask you to just stand up there for me, just looking for any signs of deformity or any uh, sense of posture change or any muscle, muscle atrophy. So, if, you know, if I can ask you to look towards that wall, if that's okay. Again, look from the side, look for a deltoid bulk and looking for any abnormalities in the scapula. Okay, if I can ask you to turn around and face the back wall for me. That's great, thanks so much. So again, looking out for any muscle changes, any bony deformities, any redness, any inflammation or swelling. Uh, if I can ask you to turn to the left and look towards the wall on your left. That's great, thanks so much. And again, look for the same things again. If I could ask you to turn and face me now. That's great, thank you very much. Okay, so now I'm just going to have a feel of your shoulder and some of the bones in your shoulder, if that's okay. okay. So I'm just going to have a feel around the shoulder for temperature. Temperature appears normal. If I can just ask you to turn around for me, that's fine. That's great, I'm just going to feel around the back, around the scalp of the temperature as well. Okay, that's great. You can turn and face me again. Okay, that's great. So I'm just going to start off by feeling uh, any bony prominences. So I want you to let me know uh, if you feel any pain at any point. So starting off at the sternoclavicular joint, moving up the clavicle. To the to the chromium, down to the coracoid process. It's great. So I'm just going to feel for your the humeral head over here as well. Okay, that's great. Okay, if I can ask you to turn around for me, that's great. I'm going to feel down the spine of the scapula. Again, have you got any tenderness along any of these no. locations? Okay, so I'm feeling for any obvious bony deformity as well. That's the medial border of the scapula. Go on. Okay. Okay, so I can ask you to turn back around and face me again. So now I'm going to do the same on the other shoulder. So again, start the sternoclavicular joint, work my way up through the clavicle, okay, to the chromium, and then down to the coracoid process, okay, and then to the humeral head. Okay, if I can ask you to turn around for me again, please. Right. Just come around the back, down the spine of the scapula, the medial border of the scapula. Okay, that's great. Okay, that's great. Thank you very much. So, I'm just going to ask you to do a few movements to announce this, okay? Just to test the function of your shoulder. Okay. Okay, cool. And I want you to let me know if you feel any pain or any discomfort at any point. Is that okay? It's fine. fine. So, if you can take your arms all the way up above your head, as far up as they can go, far up as they can go, brilliant, that's fine. If you can bring them back down as far back as they can go, and go behind. Smashing. So what I'm going to ask you now is put your hands by your sides again. Okay. And I want you to take your arms above your head again from the side as far up as they can go. Okay. Smashing. And then come back down. And then I want you to cross your arms over as far as they can go. Okay. That's brilliant. Thank you very much. I'm going to ask you a few more move movements for me. So you can uh, bend your elbows. That's great. And if I can ask you to rotate your arms out this way as far as they can go. Very good. And if I can ask you to rotate the other way, so return rotate in inwards. That's great. Okay, thank you very much. That's great. Okay. So, I'm just going to do all the same movements again, but this time I'm going to feel your shoulder for any crackles, if that's okay. It's fine. It's smashing. So, again, let me know if there's any pain or any discomfort at any point. I'm just feeling for any crepitus in the shoulder joint currently. Okay, just bring it back to me. Okay, was that all okay? That's fine. That's fine. Just throw the other arm now, if that's okay. Okay, that's great. If I'm asking you to bend your arm over here. That's great. 
Okay, relax it on. Let's go to this arm over here. Okay. Okay. That's great. Thank you. Okay, so I'm just going to ask you to do a few more movements for me again. So if I can ask you to put your arms up and slightly wider. Okay, so I'm making sure that arms are in the scapular plane. And if I can ask you to put your thumbs up and then turn your thumb over. And I want you to resist me pushing you down. Okay, very good. Okay. So if I just ask you to bend at your elbows like this. Thank you very much. So I want you to push out against my hand. Thank you very much. And I want you to push out against my other hand. That's great. Thank you very much. And finally, if I can just ask you to turn, uh, turn and face that way, if that's okay. So I want you to, uh, what I'd like to do is put your arms up your back. That's okay. And I want you to, with one of your hands, with this hand, push out against my hand. That's great. With the other hand, push out against my hand. That's great. Thank you very much. Turn and face me again. Okay, so just to finish off, I'm going to ask you to do a few special tests for me, if that's okay. So the first one, uh, what I'm going to ask you to do is put your hands against that wall and lean onto your hands, if that's okay. That's great. So I'm just looking out for any winging of the scapula. Okay, that's great. And I can ask you to turn and face me again, please. Thank you very much. Um, so what I'm going to do now is uh, I'm going to go behind you. And if I can just ask you to turn your hand this way, okay? Uh, I'm going to raise your arm and I want you to let me know again if there's any pain. Okay? I'm just doing the Nia's impingement test at the moment. Okay. Smash. And I'm going to do the same with the other arm, if that's okay. That's great. Okay. Smash. So I'm going to do another test. Um, so if you just ask you to put your hands up like this. Again, I want you to let me know if there's any pain. Just doing the Hawkins Kennedy test. Okay, smashing. And I'll move from the other side. So okay. okay. How's that feel? It's fine. Okay. So one more test. So I'm just going to let me manipulate your hand. And I'm just going to Okay, that's brilliant. Relax for me. Okay, I'm gonna go over on the other side. Any pain in your shoulder at that time? That's great. Okay. Okay, so nearly done. I'm just gonna ask you to do two more movements for me, so if that's okay. If I can ask you to put both hands behind your head, this way. Okay, that's fine. And if I can ask you to put both hands behind your back as far up as they can go. Okay, and have you got any pain or discomfort? No. Okay, that's great. Okay, so thank you so much, Harley. That completes my shoulder examination. Uh, you may get dressed again. And how would you complete your examination? So to complete the examination, I would like to do a uh, full neurovascular examination of the upper lip. I'd also like to examine the uh, C-spine and the elbow as well, and also get some uh, radiological images of the shoulder joint.